What's up guys? Brandon back here again. And we're doing another BAM box. As you notice, I've had the same shirt on for the past three videos. Well, that's because I've recorded all these videos on the same day. Trying to play catch up. <laughs> so, if you're new to my channel, don't forget to like, subscribe to my channel, and hit that notification bell for more videos. So, we are doing October 2022's BAM Horror Box. Yay. I said it right this time first. <laughs> and, uh, yeah. So, without further ado, let's get right into this. Got a lot of energy right now. Okay. Black shredded paper. We're not going to put you in a four this time. We'll put you right there. Less mess. Less clean up. Less work for me. <laughs> All right. So, we're going to take everything out of here. Oh, nope. Got some shredded paper. There we go. Put this over here on the side. And here we go. First up, we have the cheat sheet and the little chase thing. Alright, here we go. Alright, guys. Welcome back. And sorry for the weird, weird cut. Um, yeah, I thought I lost one thing, but no, it didn't. We're good. <laughs> Alright, first up. The pen we got is from Trick or Treat, and it is the little candy thing that Sam uses as a weapon in the movie. Now, this is weird. I've already checked. I've already opened up the box. It says common on here, but when I looked at the uh, cheat sheet, this right here is not a common pen. So, I don't know. We'll look at that later. Next up, we have a the Peeker sticker, which is of Jason Voorhees, and this Jason Voorhees is from the NES video game. Pretty cool. Thank you, Bam, for recognizing that video game. <laughs> and uh, there's that. Before we get to the cards, give you another peek at the list. There we go. And the back of this list. Pause it if you would like to read it. There we go. Alright. Now, for the first time since we started getting these cards, I actually don't know what I got. <laughs> so, here we go. Hopefully we got some new ones. I'd like to get an uncommon or something, but I don't know if we will. But I still like the regular cards, though. Alright, so first off, we did get a... Oh. Okay, well... Two out of four is not bad. First up, we got another Baba Duke. I'm thinking if I can get one set for myself and get another set to trade in for autograph, I will. So that's this is going for the trade in. We have a Freddy, which is really cool. I really like this. I hope we get another one. And we got another Georgie. So there's two cards I can add to trading in for an autograph. And we did get an uncommon holographic card this time, which is different from the last one we did, got. And I don't, I think this is from the movie Dead Silence. I'm not for sure. If anybody knows, if I can show it pretty well, let me know. There we go. Let me know if this is supposed to be from the movie Dead Silence or not. I would really like to know, but you can see it's holographic. But yeah, it's pretty cool. A new uncommon. I think putting these card packs in here is really it it, it adds a little element of fun to it. 
And next up is the Artist Print, and this is by Scott Jackson. I have 402 out of 2500, and this is the common one. We have Halloween Ends print. I like this. The Uncommon is pretty cool too, but I think I like this one better. With the blood red on tint on it. And Michael and Lori. Yeah, I think I like this one better. And last up, we have the autograph. It is from Final Destination, and it is Carter Smith who plays Carter. Pretty cool little, kind of like almost a poster of the movie. It's got all the people on there. So yeah, like that. And you got his little autograph right up here. Above his head. So yeah, it's pretty cool. And uh, let's see here. Car Smith. Uh, common. Uh, Final Destination. Halloween Inn. Scott Jackson was the common for it. The Peaker sticker was by Artist Birdie. And it's Friday the 13th. Now this is the one I want to show you. This is the enamel pen that's done by the same artist as last month. Addy Kaderly. It's trick or treat. Now when I show you this. If, okay. Sorry about that guys. If you look right here. Common. Uncommon. Rare. And super rare. Okay. Well by going by that. I got the rare one. Because I didn't get the glitter variant. I got the rare one. But I don't understand why it said common. If anybody in the comments knows, um, I would really like to know. <laughs> but yeah, rare is... This is where the really rare, rare, rare level items are numbered and few are made. I think that's 99. But once again, I will hold this up for you so you can take a peek of everything that you... Anybody from else that gets a bam could have got it. And I'll, there you go. There is the chase items. I'll just quickly go through these. You could have won a signed TMNT Donatello Funko Pop. A Karen Gillian signed Nebula Funko Pop. A Lee Clark signed uh, Mavis Vermilion Funko Pop. Mike McFarlane signed Master Rashi Funko Pop. Robert England signed Freddy Sketch. I would have loved that. That would have been the greatest thing I would have ever gotten this year. <laughs> um, Nev Campbell signed Screeny Mask. That's pretty cool too. And personalized celebrity shout out video. So awesome. So that's everything all the Chase winners could have got. So yeah. And that was BAM for October 2022. Can't wait for November. So remember guys, take care out there. Be safe. Have fun. Take care of yourself. And until the next video guys. Bye.